Hey guys, this is Joe Fear with GetThriveCart.com and in this video, I'm going to do a kind of a simple overview walkthrough of the affiliate modules and all the different features inside of ThriveCart. So there's definitely going to be some advanced strategies and, and advanced settings and things that you can do. We'll probably show a little bit of that in this video, but I want to kind of just give you the overview so you have a good understanding of what you can do and what you can't do with ThriveCart in the affiliate module. All right, so now we're inside of Thrivecart here. And the very first thing you wanna do before you start drumming up affiliates or any of that stuff, let's talk about how you can actually assign affiliates to products. So let's focus on that first, and then we'll talk about how you can actually get affiliates into your Thrivecart account. So to actually have affiliates promote your stuff, you need to have a product that you allow affiliates to promote. So let's just use this test product down here as an example. We just wanna to go to edit. And then from within here, you'll see a bunch of tabs on top, go to affiliates. And then it's pretty simple. <laughs> you just click this box right here. Yes, you wanna allow that. And then you have pretty much a whole bunch of different options. And it's pretty self-explanatory, but you could see, um, you know, we have allow new affiliate signups. You can auto approve, you can disable, you can manually go through each affiliate. You can use either last cookie, first cookie. Typically, we like to uh, use last cookie. That's kind of common in the industry. And then you can have expiration times for when someone uh, promotes your product, so the cookie that's dropped. So you can choose any of this here. We always stick with lifetime, but you can definitely, there's, there's reasons to do all of these other ones, uh, depending on your scenario and what you're doing there. So all you gotta do is basically, you know, for the affiliate link, the target link, this would be basically the sales page where you wanna have people promote. This is where you wanna slap that URL. You wanna put that in right there. And of course, you could do multiple uh, URLs as well. You could see, you could just add them right here. And then you pretty much just label and then put that URL right there. Again, super simple. And this is where uh, it'll allow folks to actually push people to and then have their cookie dropped as an affiliate. So you just save URLs once you enter that in. And then over here, you can actually set the commissions you want affiliates to receive when they make a sale of your product. So I'll explain this really quickly here, and this is pretty important actually, is this is where you set your overall commissions for the product itself. Now you will have the ability to actually change the commission structure for individual affiliates after they've come around and basically, you know, signed up and all that stuff. So say that you wanna have everyone that signs up automatically, they get 50% commissions off of any sale. Now, maybe you have a really high level affiliate that you know can push a lot of traffic and you wanna incentivize them. Maybe you have them make 70% uh, of each sale. You can actually go in, and I'll show you this in a minute, into the affiliates, uh, the list, and actually customize that commission for them individually. So that's a really cool option. And that's what, what's really cool with Thrivecart is it gives you a bunch of different flexibilities on how to do this. All right, so now that we have our affiliate commission set up for the product as a whole, and you can see, you know, you can actually kind of customize this again. Uh, when, when the commissions become due, you can actually have it paid out you know, seven days could be immediate, which is kind of cool for some products, or you can have it out, you know, further in the future. So that's totally up to you. And, um, and then that's, you know, how, how it kind of runs. So you're just going to want to save that. And that is per that single product. So you just got to remember that whenever you want to have people promote your products, you have to do that on an individual basis and actually allow affiliates to promote that. Okay. So now we have that product level done, what we want to do is go to the top tab to affiliates. And then inside here is your affiliate dashboard. So if we had affiliates for this uh, test account that I'm showing you right now, it would show some stats and, and all that stuff. So you could see kind of KPIs on top, commissions earned, paid, scheduled commissions that are kind of pending, and then any manual manual commissions that you've uh, that you have ready for you there. So Right down here, you're gonna see the affiliate promotions. So that are, you know, those are all the, the different stats and things that come uh, from your affiliates. And then basically the top affiliate products, you know, how things are selling, how things are being promoted from your affiliates, and then the top affiliates. And, you know, another cool strategy with affiliates is that, you know, maybe someone's sending most of your traffic 
you can incentivize them with some extra commissions or some kind of bonuses, but this is going to allow you to track all that information right here on the dashboard. Now for payouts, that's on top here. You could see you have manual payouts that you can have, or you can set automatic payouts uh, over here on the right hand side. So you can kind of manage all that here in one place, which is really nice. Obviously some options will come up uh, if you actually have commissions that you should pay, but that's all done with inside of this tab here. Now for my affiliates, this is the list I was talking about. So once you have affiliates actually sign up or you create new affiliates manually, you can do either one, or you can actually import a list. You could see here, um, you would actually search the product and then you can actually import affiliates into there or you can create a brand new affiliate. This is that list I was telling you about where you can then customize uh, basically each affiliate's profile, their settings, different commission structures, and things like that. Okay, so I wanna actually show you how to add an affiliate to your product now, or actually just to your list, but you'll see we actually have to assign them to specific products. So let's just use um, just a test. I'm gonna just type in some filler names. Uh, I'll just type in Joe and affiliate ID will just be Joe. Uh, the company name, we're just gonna just type L just as a filler. Email address will go joe at joe.com. And, um, and all this other stuff we can kind of do later. So for the product, so you could search or you could just select the product that you want them to promote. So this is the product we were just showing as an example. We'll select that one. That's a live product and we'll hit save. All right, so now we could see that Joe has been added as an affiliate on the list here. You can see some stats if you hover over as well. But what we wanna do for the example I was showing you and um, are telling you about with the commissions is to go under their profile. And first of all, you'll see a whole bunch of more stats you can kind of get into here. Uh, you can also you know, grant product access to certain products, maybe you added more, or you wanna revoke access to certain things or you just wanna check out their profile, get more details on them, their address and all that stuff. Or we can just go to affiliate options. This is where you're gonna actually change the custom commission amount for this specific person. Uh, so you can see first tab here on the affiliate options gives you their affiliate link. So this is where they can actually push to, uh, to go make some sales for that specific test product that I was showing you. Um, to actually change their commissions, this is where it gets pretty cool. So let's assume that Joe is one of your best affiliates. We wanna click this. And instead of making the 50%, let's make sure he gets paid 70% on that product. That's what's really cool. And you'll see Thrivecart makes it pretty simple. And it'll say, okay, Joe will receive 70% commission from your product's 49 price, dollar price, which is 34.30 and um, basically that'll get paid instantly. So that is how it kind of summarizes everything that will happen for the affiliate. Now, if your product had a recurring type of uh, payment, that would also give you another option to change that here. And then also if there's a bump, that would give the ability to change the amount on the bump. So it's pretty cool that you can actually customize these commissions very deep. You can, in, in a variety of ways, you can get in there and change those. Now, another cool thing is that you can actually make them a second tier affiliate for the products. So that means that, you know, if you selected this right here, you can actually have these people promote your affiliate uh, center in your program. So then they can make a commission when someone that they bring into the fold makes a sale. And you can then specify that percentage of the sale or fixed amount all right inside of here. And again, Thrivecart kind of gives you that summary so you know exactly what's going on. And then the last thing on the list obviously is you can revoke access to certain products. Um, we only have the one product right now, but we could say, boom, unfortunately, you know, this is actually a message that gets emailed to them and, um, and would take them away from, uh, or you know, remove access for that affiliate product. We don't wanna do that, because Joe's pretty awesome, he makes us a lot of money, so we're gonna close the window. Uh, but that gives you a quick rundown of everything that's happening inside of here, it's pretty cool. There's some other tabs on top where you can go into their commissions further and go into different payments uh, for paying them out and whatnot, and you would see that right up here. Uh, but that is kind of the overview of the affiliate 
um, rundown here. And let's go back here really fast and show you a couple other options. So we went through the affiliate tab. That's where we're just looking. Payouts is right there. We looked at that. Products. So this is where you actually can create the signup pages for affiliates to join your affiliate program for specific products. So if we wanted to actually look at this page first, let's just look at that. And there we go. So this is a very, um, this is just the basic page. So you could see that uh, to become a, a an affiliate, they have to, well, either if they're a Thrivecart user or not, they would click one of these buttons, but say that they are not, they would then click that. And then this is the sign up form that gets them signed up to become an affiliate. So it's really simple. Once they create the account, then they get the emails and confirmations that they are in if they're automatically approved or it'll say that, hey, you know, uh, you're pending. The product owner will come and review this and then kind of the process starts from there. All right, so let's go back to here and you can see you can customize some things here. Uh, if we go back, we can um, actually create this as a button on your website. So let's assume that you have a web page that sells your products or you just wanna have a custom affiliate sign up page, uh, whatever it might be. You can either link them to this page that we were just on or you can give them a button to uh, basically, you know, you can embed that right into your page. You can change the colors here or you can make it an image of your choosing. So it gives you some options there and it's pretty, pretty cool. Um, to set up that sign up page, this is what you do to customize. So again, there's a little button right here is customize the page. So what you can do is make it a little bit more elaborate than what we had there previously. So this is similar to checkout pages and upsell pages. You can pretty much customize this how you need to customize it. You know, you can add a little headline, edit your video, some good body text, and any other fields that you wanna collect from them. So you can see your ad or their address, telephone number, Skype name, um, their actual uh, you know, W-9 forms or W-8 for taxes. And that's for the US, but you can close that out. And that's what's really cool is you can start customizing these things, explaining your affiliate program a little further for that specific product or other ones. And, um, and just to note too, when you add more products to your affiliate uh, module, you'll see them pop up here with their own little options like you have here as well. Now, another thing you have are promotional materials. And this is pretty cool. This is stuff like swipe files, uh, videos, banners, different um, you know embeddable things that you wanna give people. All that can be done right here. So you just add it by um, basically adding, you know, clicking the button, you have the, the name of the, the actual swipe. Let's assume this is an email. So we could type in, you know, email one, maybe a little description, something, uh, you know, like it says when to send this thing out and then the actual body text of it here. And um, you can pretty much use that for anything you want. So it's, there's a lot of cool stuff and I'm not gonna go any further about the affiliate stuff because there's a lot of things you can do. Uh, like rules, for instance, we're not going to get into this, but just like if you were selling a product and someone buys, you can then set up some rules that allows you to add them to a CRM or have some kind of action happen based off of an action that they've done. So you could see, you know, when they sign up, uh, when they get approved, when they get rejected, makes a sale, refund, whatever it is, you can get them to actually you know, do different things in different CRMs that you integrate or with different custom HTML uh, third party softwares that you use. So lots of stuff and it's really cool. I'm gonna end it here so your head's not um, gonna totally explode and spin with different thoughts, but that is all. So the affiliate module is very unique to Thrivecart. It's definitely industry leading because it gives you so many options and it's completely tied in to where your transactions for your products are already happening. So for more information or any kind of questions, just comment below the video wherever you're watching or reach out to us at getthrivecart.com. We always have a staff of people waiting to answer your questions that day and we'll make sure that you're, you're synced up with the right answers and you, know, you can keep moving forward, selling your products and, and having fun doing it. So if you don't have Thrivecart yet, go get it at getthrivecart.com. 
That's getthrivecart.com. That's where you're going to get the best bonuses out there. They get you started quickly with Thrivecart. You'll make more money. You'll be able to actually learn some really cool marketing strategies that we use to basically sell all of our products, other affiliate products and whatnot, all using Thrivecart in different marketing strategies. And you're always going to get the best price when you go through getthrivecart.com. So go sign up if you don't have it. If you do, awesome. Good for you. And we'll talk soon. Ask any questions. And thanks for watching.